Hey everyone, Zero Jady here with the X-Play Fans Channel. I'm here to give a quick taste of Hoggy 2, H-O-G-G-Y, then just the number 2. The story behind this game is you are out playing with your little slime kids, they get abducted, and then you have to save them by solving puzzles, eating fruit, and getting keys. Uh, for those curious, this is actually a very easy 1K completion. It took me maybe 40 minutes or less. Uh, it's mostly just get a certain amount of uh, keys, get a certain power up in a certain level, or beat a boss. Very, very easy. Nothing complicated at all. Like I was saying before, the uh, essentially the story is you're going through these worlds, getting keys, unlocking doors. You can see up the top left there, that's that's for 40 keys. I need 40 for that. Another one down here to the right was 10 and all that kind of fun stuff like that. So you may be asking, where are these levels? They're in the pots. So each pot is its own kind of self-contained world. The goal is to get all of the uh, fruits, which turn into a key, and then you move on. So as you can see here, I have to figure my way out to get to the fruit. The acorns will make me strong. They also slow down enemies. So I've already done this one, so I need to know I need to go over here. The acorn is one use. So I'm gonna go over here, grab this, open that. I'm gonna go over here, carefully avoiding the terrible bumblebees. Get this, go down, and there you go. And that's a level. There are other uh, power-ups. There's a jalapeno that sets you on fire that allows you to kill other enemies. Uh, there's some that allow you to... There's one that's like just a giant eight ball. Oh, perfect. And you just kind of kick it off the side and there you go. So what we're going to do here is... I've already done this one. And let's see. I may have already messed this up. No, I have not. So knock that one down. Knock that one down. Knock that one down. And the only way you can move is uh, flipping from top to bottom, as you've probably seen already. And you can't fall off edges. And I have the key. And that's it. You keep going. You get more keys, more rooms, and all that kind of fun stuff like that. I recently fought a boss up here. Doo -doo -doo. All the way over here. And then there's more to go there. So there is a like a minimum requirement of keys to keep moving, but let's go ahead and do a level I haven't done yet. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, mushroom, what do you do? Oh, there's more of me. Oh, well, they sacrifice. And of course, spikes kill you, pots teleport you. It all makes sense, right? Here we go. And boom, another key. There looks like there's a bunch of these jars all over the place. All right, what else we got? Let's go in this one. Oh, look at all those bees. So fire essentially destroys everything, makes me Im immune. But... I don't want to kill the fruit, so I need to set my put myself out, and there we go. And that's how everything's kind of been introduced. It's a very basic rollout of stuff. Let's see. Let's keep going. Ah. All right. So this one, I know what to do. Go down here. Can't do that quite yet. So what I want to do is this. Launch him. Nope, not quite. Alright. Do that. Oh, almost. Okay, do that again. And I'll probably have to do it one last time. You know, clean all that up for me, and then uh we can get out of here. Oh, nope. Well, there's one more. I didn't see that. Not gonna be hard. Yeah. Not quite. Oh, a little too far. There is some uh, timing-based ones, but they're never actually difficult at all. If I feel, though, that some of the puzzles later on might actually get crazy hard. The, the early puzzles in the kid mode are, like, incredibly simple. That's my stats. Like I said before, about 40 minutes to complete it if you want to get all the achievements. 
I don't remember any of these puzzles really standing out, so let's go ahead and just do another one I've already I haven't done yet. Never let anything touch the death. Okay. Do 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 do. I wonder if that counts as anything. Nope, we're good. Keep on moving. So these guys will attack you in line of sight. So if I go, wow. But I've kind of messed that up there because I need him to uh, come on out. So what I need to do is first get him to go over here, there, there, here we go. Right, what do we got? Oh yeah, there you go. Then we move on to the next one. Like I said before, they, they, they don't really take that much thinking even at the harder ones but I am still only about 26 in or so so these uh which my call is it so, so I don't want him to die quite yet all right wait what do I, oh no I know what I need to do I think I know what I need to do See, what I think I need to do is that I need to get him to go all the way up there to the explodies. Alright, yeah, I just need to kind of corner him. And then we just need to do that again. Yeah. Yeah. Don't want you uh, running off there, buddy. Here we go. He's gonna explode there and we will reap the, the fruity benefits. Yes. But like I said before, it's very simple. The, uh, nothing has taken me more than maybe one or two tries unless I've just died for no reason. This area was actually unlocked with a, uh, with a, uh, what's it called? Not an acorn, a, uh, star. So what this does here is, oops, that was a bad idea. So, this is a good show off. These acorns, when they, you use them, actually will slow down the enemy's attacks as well. Oop, did not want to do that. Oh, I keep messing that up. We tried this first. All right, do this. Nope, that's not gonna work. But there was another one of the puzzles that was very similar to this, where I had to go in, uh, actually destroy a guy, and then outrun bullets. Uh oh. We got this, hold on. So I can't actually go that way because it'll murder me. Uh oh, oh, there it is, death. But anyways, that's Hoggy 2. If you want an easy, really easy puzzle game, this is probably for you. If you want a really easy 1K, again, this is for you. Let's go to the main menu real quick. You can make levels. Like I said before, there's a uh, kids game and then normal game and then oh, there's 260 levels. That's a lot. But like I said before, the kids game, super easy. Uh, the puzzles are crazy easy. Let me actually go and see how long this took me. Yes, you can switch slimes. It took me out 15 minutes. So it's about a 50, like just just under an hour for completion if you don't know what you're doing. Anyways, I am Zero JD. This is the x -Play Fan Channel. This was Hoggy2. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Like, comment, subscribe, share our videos. It helps us a ton. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye.